Leslie, I don't think you truly understand how much you really mean to me. There's literally nothing that I wouldn't do for you. You've always been there for me. And vice versa, Leslie, there's something I... Where's Dean? Look, you go this way and I'm gonna go this way. We gotta find Dean. Dean! 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 Where are you? Dean! There you are. Don't you ever run from me like that again, okay? You know how much you scared me? Kevin! I knew I'd seen that charming face before. Michelle? Yes! I thought that was your son. I remember you brought him to the office that day. He was all over the place. It's no wonder he got away from you. Thank you so much for stopping him up. I don't know what I would have done if he... It was good seeing you. Who is that woman? <coughs> Could she be wearing any more perfume? Now let's go. Hopefully you won't lose your son when you drop him off at your mom's later. Late night ponder, instrumental shaking thoughts that seem to shake like thunder. Today's the day, or maybe tomorrow. In the front door. Hey, baby, is that you? Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, babe. I went by my mom's house. She told me that you went and picked up Dean. I mean, as much as I love seeing her. I bet you do love going to see her. What? Babe, have you, have you seen my blue basketball shoes anywhere? I mean, you haven't seen my basketball shoes anywhere? Like, I need them because I'm supposed to be going to play with the guys later this week. Like on the Hey yo, it's Kevin. Yo, what's up, Kev? Dude, I've been trying to reach you all week, man. Where have you been? Bro, what the fuck happened to your face? I'm sorry, I'm late, fellas. I, I had an issue I had to take care of. Hey, Kev. Why did you always hurt me? You good, bro? You really been tripping these days. Yeah, dude, what's really going on? Nothing. Y'all ready to play ball? I know what happened. Leslie don't put them hands on me. Hey, yeah, she'll take this shit, dude. Kevin, what you done did now? Unlike the rest of y'all, I don't be cheating on my girl. What's up, man? I was just calling to check up on you. Yeah, I'm good, man. I'm just just headed to the house. Cool, cool. You know, I was really calling to check up on you. You know about the accident the other day. You know this ain't the first time she done something like this. Man, I know, but but you don't get it. What is there not to get? If you continue to put up with this, you only man, making it hard to leave. I knew I never should have told you. Like. What what I look like calling the police on my girlfriend? I can handle my own shit. I don't need any outside help from you or anybody else. Plus, plus I'm not trying to raise Dean in a broken home. I I grew up like that and I know what it feels like. I'm really trying to make this thing work with Les, okay? Look, I ain't trying to start nothing with you. All I'm saying is, get out before it's too late. All right, man. It whatever. I'm I'm pulling back up at the house now. Uh, shit. Um, where have you been? 
know where I've been. Excuse me, I've been calling you. I told you I was going to play ball with the guys today. So you can't answer your phone while you're with your friends now? I was playing ball, not chill. You probably weren't even with them. You were with her, weren't you? Every single day is something different with you. How many times do I have to tell you that you're the only one? That's a lie. That's a lie. You come in here every other day smelling like perfume. I know you've been with her, haven't you? Why is it always something with you? Every single day, I always have to tell you what I've done and who I'm doing it with. It's only you. Then explain to me why you come home with the smell of perfume on your shirt. <laughs> Don't walk away from me. You hear me? I do the same thing every day. I get off work, pick up Dean from my mom's house, and then bring my ass back here. Leave and I'll call the police. Call the goddamn police! I ain't doing shit to you. Not to me, but that poor girl you ran over and killed. I'm sure the police would love to know how you put your drunk best friend in the driver's seat. I did exactly what you told me to do. You said I would lose you and Dean if I didn't, so I did exactly what you told me to do. I'm so tired of you thinking you can control me like I'm your little bitch. The hell with that. I'm gone. Listen, I don't mean to bother you, but I'm on my way to go bail Kevin out. And I thought it was only right that I stop in and just apologize for the actions of my son. I still can't believe he could ever do anything like this. too hard to believe now. It just angers me as a mother. I raised him to never hit a woman. I just don't understand. I just don't understand how he could do something like this. But you know what? Before I get us both worked up, I think I better go. Take care, my love.
assume. Looks like you made bail, Mr. Ross. <sighs> what happened to your face? Don't don't worry about it. It's it's okay. You know what? I went over there to the house. I talked to her. Something does not add up. And I tell you what. I'm just happy I didn't propose to so. I don't know what is going on, but I don't trust it. She, she's trying to make it look Baby, like Baby, I believe you. I don't know what she's trying to pull, but if I find out she's lying, there will be. 